hello guys and welcome to my new video in this video i'm gonna be showing you how to root your android by installing a, a virtual machine in your android phone it doesn't matter what kind of android you have by installing this application you can be uh you can be able rooting your android so guys i will show you first of all that i'm using android 10 i'm using s9 android 10 here i will show you guys that it is it's really work on in Android, right? I recorded a video showing you how to do this process, but with another application that is called Vimos. But the Vimos has some problem. If your Android phone hasn't, has not uh, enough memory, it will not work. But today I bring to you guys a new application X8 Sandbox that you can install it and root your android and use a virtual machine in your android so guys i will show you that i'm using here android 10 okay this is my software information over here so as you can see guys i have android 10 all right once we are here i'm going to install things to i'm going to install the x8 sandbox the virtual machine that you can use on an android device all right so first of all guys before we do the process, before we install the X8 and box, make sure to subscribe to my channel, click the bell, click the bell there to get notified when I upload a new video and let's get started. So once we're here, download, I will leave the, the link on the description to download the X, X8 and box. So you can download from the link here or you can type on google and you can search from there all right so now i'm going to install it from my my storage here i have already downloaded x8 and both as you can see guys watch the video carefully and follow the all steps all right do you want to install this application yes i want to install it so remember guys to have at least one gb in your free memory space have one gb okay so it will take a while while it's installing so be patient and wait good guys once we install it x8 sandbox we're gonna click on done and let's go back so now i will show you guys that my phone it's now installed x8 this is the application that we are going to use to show you that it is working okay now i'm going to show you that my phone isn't rooted for now okay i will use i will use this root checker basic to show you and that my phone isn't routed so as you can see guys my phone is not routed sorry root access is not properly installed on, on this device so guys once we did this i will leave as well the root checker on the description you can download it and see if your phone if your phone is routed or not all right so you can download it from the link that i will leave on the description okay once we did this guys so let's let's open x8 and box it will take while one minute at least one minute while it's installing and we're gonna confirm the all we're gonna be agree here sure click on it and low here we're gonna low this uh, unbox here it's starting guys as you can see my application is already installed in my phone okay so guys as you can see the operating environment in itself as you can see guys my phone it's already installed sandbox okay i have google here i can click on it and it will work guys as you can see down here there is some second that i can i have to wait while the google play store is installing in my as you can see guys my google play store is already installed on my phone so we can sign in okay it is a virtual machine that you can do any process that you can do as well in your original machine i will log here on my 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 one of my google accounts show you that it's really working it doesn't need another address your new account and use it so be patient guys as you can see up let's type here a gmail account
Okay. I already I already logged in with my Gmail account. M is done. Let's accept here. No, I don't need any updates. Nope. Okay, guys, as you can see, my phone, I logged with this Google account up here. Okay. So now let's go back. If you can just you pay attention that you menu button is alright this side here and you can see that I can as you can see my super user is already installed in my phone so guys you're gonna go back okay you're gonna go back click on add apes click on it and you're gonna open and you can add any application that you're using in your phone for example i will add here my whatsapp all right and i will add here my add the application uh the log butcher and i will add here okay root checker all right it is adding some application that i already clicked click it so yes okay good so now guys to root you at uh, your, your device this bell over here settings okay click on settings on settings and click if you want to enable export from work you're gonna click on it and if you want a route manager you're gonna click on it as On some road okay root man as you can see guys I wrote the manager is already on my phone if you want to root your Android you're gonna click on root manager and as you can see my phone it rooted so I'm gonna go back here and that's it guys Changing exposed firmware will restart the sandbox. Okay, no problem. It will restart and then. Alright. Once we have here exported, install it, and super user is already installed it. Okay, let's click on super user and you will see that it, the phone is rotated. If you want to change some application here, you can type on Perfect. and uh, app is only, and you have more configuration here. Okay. Okay, as you can see, guys, I have here settings. As I said. I have super user. We're gonna go back and uh, that's it guys as you can see i have already super user installed it so now let's see if my phone my virtual machine is rooted Okay, this is the time to see if my phone is rooted or not. My virtual machine. As you can see guys, my phone is being verified in road access and installation on this device. As you can see guys, it's asking me uh, to allow or deny here. Alright, this means that my phone is 100% rotated guys so now you can see this virtual machine really work on any device and an android device so you can do it 
by yourself and now you can be installing any application that you want on this android machine okay guys i will i will open here the lock patcher to show you that it's working and then we're gonna try another application so guys i already opened it and it's asking me in, and it's asking me uh to allow here a road checker okay hello as you can see guys my, my lock patcher is is rotated so that's amazing so uh i will type on remember choose forever and allow it so as you can see guys i'm using i don't need